Cheating is not a new idea, but technology is helping cheaters come up with new tactics. We've uncovered that college students are turning to complete strangers online to help them get to the top of their class. In tonight's special report, Cheating 101, Emily Zink spoke with one woman cashing in on the deceitful opportunity. According to a U.S. News and World Report, around 75% of college students admit to cheating. Having something in your sleeve. Like you looking on your phone underneath the desk. Or writing it on your desk and putting your paper over it, I guess, would be. I've seen people do it, and I might have done it. And ever since the age of the Internet, cheating has gone high tech. It's nothing new. For more than a decade, college students have turned to the Internet to cheat. But now a website that's quickly gaining popularity makes it even easier to type in a URL, sit back, and get an A. It cost me about $20 to create the website. Um, after my first week of launching the website, I had already made $3,000. New York native Jessica Mott went from making $30 an hour tutoring to making well over half a million dollars after creating the website paymetodoyourhomework.com. It's very, very, very addictive. So if you use my service once and you are like completely failing, all of a sudden you receive your first A, it's very addictive. You will continue to use my service so that you continue having great grades. PayMeToDoYourHomework.com has been online for a little over three years and has more than 7,000 customers. It's not more at all, but <laughs> is it legal? Yes. The website's name says it all. College students are paying tested experts to do their homework or take their tests. Essays run anywhere between $15 to $50 per page, and basic assignments cost $20 to $500. And it's possible for an expert to take a test for you, but it will cost more than $500. $100. They will videotape the test, send it to us, and we have 35 to 40 minutes to get the answers back to them. Mott says none of her clients have ever been in trouble for academic dishonesty. The site uses IP blockers to protect its users. As long as there is a demand, Mott says the website will continue making cash. The clear cut one, the fastest path to plagiarism is here. Like you bought it, you copied it, you took your roommate's paper, or whatever it is. Academic professionals agree students are wasting their money on sites like paymetodoyourhomework.com. Most students should never need that, that they can produce the writing that they need to produce. If you don't have this on your citations page, it can be considered as plagiarism. Travis Adams runs the Writing Center at UNO, where students, faculty, and staff can get help on any writing assignment they're working on. This might need to be in quotation marks and it, or might need to be italicized. Adams says the Writing Center's goal is to keep students from getting to the point where they feel like they need to cheat. The goal is to help students be more confident in their own writing and produce that writing and give themselves time to do that writing. Adam says cheating your way through college will only put you behind in the real world. That person's cheating themselves out of the education and they're going to go in the job market and I don't think it's going to take that long before an employer sniffs that out. Emily Zink, KMTV Action 3 News.